dash back. Happens. And we've been so brainwashed by pickup marketing over the years that, oh, this pickup is going to give you tone A, or this other pickup is going to be the magical cure that you're looking for that's going to make your tone so much better. And it just does not fucking work that way at all. Let me show you exactly what I mean. Here's that 10 guitar shootout once more, but this time showing you the differences in the guitars being played. Here we go. So after seeing Glenn Fricker's pickup comparison video, I decided to do my own test with three of my seven string guitars, all tuned to drop A, same string gauges. One guitar has a Seymour Duncan Nazgul in the bridge position, another guitar has a Seymour Duncan Omega in the bridge position, another guitar has a Balaguer Feral humbucker in the bridge position. You'll hear four different comparisons, one in a full mix, one just the guitars, and another one with the gain down 10% just the guitars, and another one just the clean DI tracks. The biggest differences I could hear was an actual physical output or volume of the pickups. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks.
And probably like most of you, I was really surprised by Glenn Fricker's uh, comparison video. So I decided to do my own test and still the differences are pretty minimal. This is pretty surprising, especially since I've seen a lot of YouTube comparison videos, including the OG Keith Merrow pickup videos and a lot of England. So I don't know how they got the differences they got, but this is the results I got. Like, comment, and subscribe for more guitar and metal-oriented content to come.